Hello, teacher Jackie here with all the props. No, these are not all my props, <laughs> some of them, but let me give you some ideas and tips on props that are easy. I just did a video, but I just last night prepared for a class and found a much easier, much easier, faster, better way to do this. Let me share my screen. I am going back into my good old trusty Canva. C-A-N-V-A dot com. Go to Canva. Here we are. This is when you go into Canva and I clicked on templates. Now we want just a normal like piece of paper template. Before I had told people to do an Instagram shape, but we're going to go ahead and just do a flyer. And there was like an eight and a half. Last time I typed it in, it did like a landscape. There we go. Eight and a half by 11. On its side, pick the blank one. It's much easier because you'll have access to all those templates inside the program. People may not know that. Right here, we'll see it says templates. So you get a blank one, but all the templates you just saw previously are in here. So always just click on the blank one. Otherwise, you're just you know, adding all these things that don't need to be in here. So you can find a template, but we're not doing that. We just want to get a 2D prop real quick, real easy. As you can see here, I had looked up the word road and just went ahead and put the road in here and then made it bigger, click and drag, click and drag, and that's it. I actually did put at the bottom. I needed a new page. I needed a left, click and drag. Oops, it's off the page, there we go. Click and drag. Now, of course, I could actually duplicate this with the duplicate button. Let me just show this. I can do a new page and click on the other one, right? I could do that. Or let me go ahead and trash it. Let me show you some more of the features. This one is duplicate and I can click on it and I can just flip it. <laughs> there I know it's the same size, same position, same everything. So what's nice, what makes this so much more easier than my other is the download. It'll automatically download as a P multiple page PDF, which I do. And then when I print it, I can print two of these on one page when I do my print options. So for me, that was the best, easiest, fastest way. And I'll show you real quick what that looked like. Actually, I just clip these together, organizing myself. So here it is, here is the road and it's on a page by itself because I did my left and right on a page together. So I just quickly folded it in half before class. And when we did the class, I would show this and then later I'd flip it, show that. And then I would talk about the road. And we also had a car and a bike, a bus and a train. And this makes it quick, easy. These are clip arts that I know are royalty free and legal and all that fancy stuff. And then I clip them together with, um, my timeline. This is my slides number and my, um, the time. So I know between how to pace myself. So I hope this was helpful. I hope this was good and easy that much, much easier than my other one. It was a little more complicated. So again, open Canva, get a landscape flyer, go to a blank one and go to elements and click on and, and search. All right. Thank you guys. This is whew, this. We can get through this, can't we? <laughs> I hope this was helpful. Please like, subscribe, share, and ask me questions and I'll help try to answer them. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>